Alright. Here's what I got so far. Pretty much done. I don't know, something might get changed down here. Got some animated water type textures I made. Of a school of hammerhead sharks. Try not to make this video long, but it's, it's actually pretty big, this map. made two textures, animated textures for this. The animated bubbles, bubble look like this. I wanted to put bubbles in there, a few bubbles or whatever, but it's animated textures, you can't see through the text, the bubbles through the textures. You can pretty much see everything else, except you can't see the other animated texture on the, uh, on the cryo chamber tubes. a couple different models from uh, you know from Sketchfab animation they're kind of a little messed up and they kind of stopped and glitched and stuff but like each one of those models right there came from a whole complete sequence I literally took them apart and took what I wanted out of it and put to get put it together this way, the way I wanted it. I think it looks pretty cool. Definitely gonna change this thing. I don't like, I don't like the way that looks right there. Put a bowl, bowl looking thing there looks better. Yeah, science labs right here. Playing around with lighting now. Pretty much done. Maybe a couple little changes and fixes and stuff like that. But for the most part, I'm pretty much done. Except the spawn room, I still gotta set like all the guns and all that stuff up. Not sure. There's, I'm probably gonna put some things kind of blocking the runway, so at least you got some type of cover. Yeah, I think it's looking good. Looks like, yeah, it's definitely gonna be a fun map to play on. I don't know, I'm probably gonna change that up there. I'm already over the 100,000 
memory mark, so I'm just hoping all the assets and everything I got all over the sky from or like modular sets to build walls and all that stuff. I'm hoping all that stuff takes up or takes away a lot of that memory I'm over. I'm probably gonna have to use streaming mode on like maybe the spawn room areas or something. The bubble texture I created. Made a spear. Created the bubble texture and threw it on the tube. Got two tubes right there. One was bubble, and then I shrunk the other one a little bit. That looks like the little whirling tornado inside it. Now I'm gonna try to make this at least 10 minutes. It's kind of big. I had, I had to put never call distance on some of the things like these lights or else you could only see to light right here it all disappeared so I had to never call distance on all them lights so at least you could completely see them all I like the way that came out. Came out pretty good, I think. Oh, I didn't even see the stairs. Yeah, I just built those. It's gonna be a dark room. No lights. Pretty much done with this one. It's gonna be like the stargazer's room. I had to paint these white though. If they were black, you literally couldn't even see them. Or I threw a white texture on it. Here's a bunch of the acid stuff. I'm hoping all see all that stuff goes all the way over there. And on the other side. I'm hoping all that stuff takes away a big part of that memory usage. Cause I think I'm at like 109,000 or something. See I had to never call draw distance on those, the tubes and stuff. Which took up a little bit of memory. But I wanted to be able to see those Whoever can go look at and see that room. Yeah, I'm just playing with lighting on this side. Just playing around with lighting now. And then I'm going to duplicate this whole side all the way to the center on the other side. And then everything that's red here, I'm going to turn that blue. Felt like I had to put a lot of windows in it so they could see space and all the animated plants and stuff go around. It's almost pointless to have no windows, but this is the only place you can see that. I have to actually load this place up with windows.
think rapid ledge. Yeah, I don't have a level of balance yet. Actually, I do, but it's probably way down there. Let's do some guns in and test it. A little animated fire type texture. See, it's capture a flag map. Put one flag probably right here. Either right there or directly right here. It's a spawn room. Don't need that all fancy, just basic square box. I'm trying to save memory. spawn away over here. Yeah, I'm kind of tired. Now I've been working on this thing for like non-stop pretty much. So I'm, my head, fingers are literally not even pushing the button to grab the ledge or run. Take that little thing out because it stops you sometimes. Right out here. Well, actually, I don't even need to just run and jump. That's probably the last thing right here in the video. It's probably been way long. Probably gonna fix those so you don't go so like high up. Like that. And go a little lower. That's it. Now I can't wait to get this finished. Next map is going to be an obstacle type course map. Animated blocks. And stuff like that. Alright. Let me know what you think. Been working on this a really long time changed it. I don't know how many times I've changed it. But it's just a couple of little changes and that's it. But I mean I literally did major changes by deleting and completely starting areas over.